Hello, it's me, Anna. I'm here on this beautiful rainy day, sitting outside the school, and I'm here to explain to you my CM20 capstone. All right, let's get into it. So my CM20 started in like February, I think, yeah. And the first labs we did were shot labs. Those were labs one to four. And the first lab was, um, we just explained what the shot was, described it, how to do the shot, and the feeling of the shot that you get. And the second lab I did with Sierra, and that was we had to do the shot. We had to make a video of the shots that we explained in the first lab. <clears throat> um, I quite enjoyed this video. I thought it was fun. I thought it was easy. I had a good time. It did take a lot of time. Um, it did take a lot of time out of school because we couldn't really video in class so it was a lot of extra time but in the long run it was worth it. And then the third and fourth lab was like pretty much the same thing. We just in the third one we explained shots, how to do them, and what they were. And in the fourth one we made a video, and that one I did with Sierra again. And yeah, here's a little clip of my fourth one. After we finished the shots labs, me, Sierra, and Harmi did the Foley sound project, which was we I took a video that Mr. Lundrum provided us that had no sound and we made our own sound effects. And I, this is probably one of my favorite ones I'd say. I don't know why, but I just, I never thought that like movies had sound effects. Like I never actually thought about that. And I, like when we were making the sound effects, we used some things that I would have never expected to use in sounds and stuff. And yeah. And then the next video I did was the surprise ending video. I did this video with Brendan, Ethan, and Isaac. Um, I completely am disappointed in this video. It is not how I wanted it to turn out. It, yeah, I don't know. It was just a huge disappointment for me. I didn't really enjoy it. It was stressing me out all year because we wouldn't do it. It took us so long to get the video done and it's just not what I wanted, you know. But one thing I did learn from that um, project was to not partner up with people that are two labs behind you. I should partner up with people that are on the same project as me because then, yeah, and then maybe I would have had a better project and wouldn't have been so stressed out about it. But you know what? People make mistakes, I'll learn for next year. And then, after we did all those videos, we moved on to the photography portion of CM20. Um, before we did photography, we did these little quizzes, and I, they're not fun quizzes, they're quizzes, nobody likes quizzes. But they're, they're helpful, they're very helpful, and yeah. I suggest that you do them and pay attention to them because you learn about camera operation and photos and you know stuff like that. <clears throat> Our first photography project that we had to do was portraits. We had to take 10 portraits and I I didn't enjoy it, honestly. I don't I don't know why I didn't enjoy this particular photography thing but I was just it was giving me troubles it was just it was not it was just one it was just 
not going my way and my photos were being deleted and like just it wasn't going how I wanted it to and it really put me behind on my projects but what I learned from this project was the different types of photos that people take and practicing how to do them and and I got better at taking the photos because I don't know I did so many of them because they were giving me a hard time and I just I got really good at them and yeah after that we did the freeze time the depth of field and the night shots these were our last projects that we had to do these projects I did enjoy they were easy fun and a good learning experience for me um, the one I enjoyed the most was the night shots they were kind of boring to do and they kind of took a long time but like what or how the photos turned out was like really nice I liked how the photos turned out I liked how they looked and stuff um, and yeah but that was pretty much it you know um, all in all CM20 was a good class I had lots of fun with it I enjoyed my classmates and I enjoyed the teacher and um, I had a lot of laughs and I just I can't wait to be back next year so yeah that's it.